We are at World Market today. I am so excited. They had so many amazing things out. I love looking at these displays too. They just give you such creative ideas. So this is the Brin sofa. It was actually on sale. The Brin, they have a sofa in the blue and in a kind of a cream color. They also have a chair in the navy and the cream color. And I have been eyeing the cream chair for a while. I just haven't been able to pull the trigger on the $500 price tag on those, but very popular design and so soft. So we're gonna see a good amount of furniture today as well as home decor pieces. And I will say World Market's furniture is really high quality. I think that you get what you pay for with their furniture. So I would highly recommend it. It's definitely not like some cheap stuff, but also it's not as expensive as places like Pottery Barn and West Elm. This is the large version of the Everett foyer table. It's $400, a very popular design. I would say for the past like five, seven, eight years, I have seen so many people have that table in their home. It's very pretty. This little end table right here was $200. I always try to look for sales, but usually like they don't have them very often. So when you do come across a sale, it's a good idea to snatch it up. This is that Brin chair. I sat in it and it was so comfy. Definitely worth the price tag, but I'm still hoping it goes on sale at some point. They had some outdoor furniture out. This section right here was just stunning. $550 for that chair. It's definitely something that you need to plan for and realize you're probably going to spend a decent amount on outdoor furniture, but this was just so gorgeous and I could definitely picture myself sitting here for hours every day in the summertime. World Market's pillows definitely have that boho vibe to them. Occasionally you can find some that don't have that vibe going on if that's not your style, but if you love that boho casual feel, World Market is definitely the place to go for those pillows. We'll see some more of these later too, but they have a nice selection of these kind of velvety pillows. They're 18 by 18. They were on sale during this video for about a little over $10 and they have like every color imaginable. I did like this pillow. It reminds me of like Amber Interiors style and that was $40, but a nice size. Here is a rounded chair, a very popular style lately. I love a lot of the world market chairs have taller backs and I really like that. They are just so much more comfortable when they have a higher back. This little console table I thought was so cute. You could use it as a console table like in your front entryway or for a media center if you wanted to have a TV on top of it or above it. A beautiful kind of rust orange color of a love seat, super comfy. I love that style too. Then this laptop table was 150. Their marble and tables are amazing at World Market. Just the marble on top, you can tell is very high quality, solid, and just beautiful veining. This was a beautiful mid-century cabinet, $600 for that, but a good size and just really pretty with that dark wood and the gold. Here's another one of those chairs in a really pretty teal color, $450 for that. This coffee table was gorgeous and I wish I would have picked it up because it's just beautiful. $400. I liked so many things in this store. This was actually considered a desk, but I would definitely use this as a front entry table. It is so beautiful, $500. And I did look at that when we first purchased our home, but it was just a little bit too big for my space.
They had a whole wall of baskets in the back of the store. I love that there's such a variety to choose from. So if you really want to use neutral baskets, they had those. This was a nice Serena and Lily dupe and it was a good size. It was $90, but it was very sturdy. Baskets have so many uses. You can have them in your living room for extra blankets or pillows. You could also put kids' toys in them. We also use baskets for dirty and clean clothes, so as a little hamper as well. It's very nice and convenient for my kids to just take those handles and take them to the laundry room. There was no price on these vases, but just a nice neutral design. It could really fit with any style. This is so pretty. That woven on the front just brings in some nice texture and dimension to it. $800, so definitely an investment piece, but so many uses for that. You could definitely use it in a dining room for your glasses and plates and extra storage that you need for kitchen items. These little end tables were a nice, cute design, something different to add to your home or even adorable in like a kid's bedroom for a little nightstand. World Market has a great kitchen section. If you've never checked it out, we're gonna take a peek over here. They usually have some fun mugs. I like those like for my kids, just some fun patterns on them. This tray was $20. That would be really amazing on a coffee bar and you could set some of the mugs on there and maybe a canister with your coffee beans. These glasses were so beautiful, $10. They were definitely real glass, but World Market has has a lot of beautiful glasses with a lot of that texture and pretty design on them. $35 for this gold tray. This would be amazing on a kitchen counter. You could put a little bit of fruit in there or you could put like a candle and then like a little jar of spoons or something. I don't know, so many uses for all of these trays. I love having trays around my home, on my kitchen counter, on my coffee table. So many things you can do with them. Here's some more of those pretty glasses, a nice green color, again, $10 for those as well. World Market also has a lot of good wood products like wood cutting boards and charcuterie boards. I really don't know how to say that word, but, and this was kind of like a dough bowl that you could use, $25, which I thought was a pretty good price for that. And look at all the marble. I mean, so pretty. Like I said, with their end tables, just the veining in these is so high quality, you can tell. And I love all the variety over here. This black one right here was $30. I love that big handle. You can just use all of these cutting boards and trays for statement pieces in your kitchen. In my last home, I definitely had cutting boards kind of all over my kitchen, and it was just fun. It brings in a warm, cozy vibe with those wood tones. I have this olive oil dispenser in my own kitchen. It's $9, a beautiful dark green color. So it just adds a little bit of color to my kitchen without being overwhelming. This arched storage cabinet is stunning. We've seen this all over from places like Anthropology. It was $900, a beautiful dark wood tone with the black handles. $500 for this chair right here, a beautiful gray color, so soft, and it looks very high-end. Something you would see from like our house or a Pottery Barn in West Elm. Beautiful chairs right here. This one was also $500. The beaded look to it with the dark wood was just beautiful.
This floor lamp caught my eye with this beautiful shade on it with the ridges and then the gold and the black. Definitely something I would be picking up if I needed another lamp. We're going to come over here to some of the home decor items like these beautiful vases. So many options to choose from. I love that they have a good variety, but they do kind of have that old world look to them. And the coloring is also a little bit more vintagey. You see a lot of amber colors, browns, muted gold colors as well. This tray caught my eye $60. This would be beautiful inside or outside. It was very sturdy. So if you were carrying drinks inside and outside, that would be a great find or just having some candles on there on your outdoor table. It's crazy to think of outdoor time already when there's snow on the ground here. They have a beautiful assortment of overhead lights, just that boho vibe, which is also nice and warm and cozy. World Market has a beautiful dining table and chair selection over here. I found a few tables and chairs that I just absolutely loved. So if you're in the market for a new dining table, you can definitely check World Market out. This one right here was gorgeous. I love the fluted bottom and the round edges. Very elegant and classy, but I feel like it would hold up well for a family too. I watch you as you drive. Do you know I'm looking? And I can't help but smile. Do you know how much I love you? You put my favorite song on. I put my feet up. We've seen the darker wood tones really be on trend lately, and I feel like World Market is following that trend with these darker walnut color of tables. And those chairs were so fun, all the different colors. This is a nice, like you could use it as a console table. You could use it as kind of like a bar cart in a dining room to put all your glasses on. And then over here, they had a ton of chairs. It's really nice to see these in person. And if you can get them down, you can sit in them and kind of test them out too. This gold bar cart with the mirrors on it is $250. It was kind of hiding in the corner somewhere. So if you're interested in it, you just need to look around. You can also get World Markets things shipped to you. So if I were to buy like a bigger piece of furniture, I would definitely have it shipped to me. These chairs were so comfy, $500. I love the different colors and they just looked super comfy, especially if you had like a kid space or a playroom, those would be nice for the kids to be on too. They had a nice little setup here with this coffee table and then a display on top. This candle right here is $15. I always gravitate towards like the more neutral ones that have maybe a little bit of a texture or gloss to them. Just something a little bit fun in your home. We're going to take a look at some of the mirrors and artwork that they have out. They always have fun mirrors, some unique styles, but then also some more modern styles. I loved that black one right there. That is very popular lately, that style, and it was $200. These were the rest of those pillows I was talking about earlier. They're originally like 14 or 15 and they're on sale for 10 50 but if you just need kind of a filler pillow with this, this neutral color and no pattern on it, that's a good place to look. This black mirror right here was $300. What I love about World Market is that their things aren't the same as you would see from like a Target or Wayfair. They're just a little bit different and unique and you can really put those in your home to give your home that unique feeling. Then it's not like the same as everyone else's. 
I also love their art pieces. Usually they're a little different. I absolutely loved this black one right here for 180, but even their canvas prints, they look higher end. They don't look like they were just printed on there and they did a sloppy job with them and they look fake. They look really good and classy. I would definitely look at World Market for all of their art pieces. And then something like that that was 140, very beautiful. And again, just a little unique unique for your home. I am very picky about my greenery. It definitely needs to look real. And there are some stores that just don't do a good job of that. But World Market, I think, does a great job of their greenery selection. It's not huge, but I think the leaves usually look pretty realistic. And then they have planters that are really fun and cute and just not like your plain, normal, ordinary planters. This one right here was $43. So definitely a little bit more, but I really feel like those leaves look more realistic than some of the other places I've seen. $40 for this one right here. I love the shape of that vase. And again, that greenery looks great. A nice selection to choose from over here if you want to just buy a planter and you can put your own plant in it or buy one of the faux greenery pieces. This was a nice black vase, $10. They had a few different styles to choose from. Coming over here to some of the candles and candle holders, they usually, again, have a few unique finds, which is what I love. This small black one right here is $15. You could put a real candle in there or a flameless one. I always love my flameless candles from Amazon. I thought these were adorable. This is great for a tea light. $8 for that flower one. They have like this white, a green, a beautiful blush pink, and a black. But these would be perfect in a bathroom if you have company coming over. This one was only $3, but having those in a bathroom or by your kitchen sink would just be nice and inviting. I loved the shape of these, just something different. This was $15. That white one right there was my absolute favorite. I've been seeing this pattern out a lot lately. I've been going to a few stores for you, coming videos, and I have seen those quite a few places. So I'm excited to share those with you soon. I loved these candle holders. $20 for the smaller one right here. These would look amazing on a mantle. Definitely like a modern contemporary vibe, which is something that I love. I wish I would have picked those up, but I guess it just means I have to go back. This amber colored vase was $15. You could also put a smaller flameless candle in there or use it for flowers or greenery, but that amber color seems to be really popular lately. This little vase right here was about $2.50. Quite a few colors to choose from, which is really nice. So you can kind of blend it with the style of your own home. Those are nice by a kitchen sink or in a bathroom on a windowsill or even just next to your bed with a small flower in it. They had this really pretty green color too. I love that they had a variety of different shapes and sizes to choose from. This one right here was $13. My favorite was the one above it right here. Again, that same pattern that I've been seeing lately. I love the two-tone and that one was $25.
coming over here to some more planters. These ones are very neutral. Some of them have that ribbing on the edges of them and a few different patterns and colors. Very neutral section. This white one caught my eye. This one was $22, but just a nice subtle design that looks like it's slightly folded over. They had a beautiful selection of full flowers and greenery. Definitely somewhere to check out if you are looking for that type of thing. There are just so many places that they don't look realistic, but I think all the ones here were really beautiful and definitely looked real. This vase right here was $20. I love the subtle design, the two-tone, and the color is neutral enough that it will blend in with your current decor, but also just gives you kind of that little pop of dimension. This gold and glass vase was $13. This would be really pretty on like the back of a kitchen counter by your backsplash just to have a simple flower in there. And then this one right here was $22. This tree was 150. It didn't come with that bottom planter that's separate, but I really liked this one. It wasn't like going all over the place and crazy, but it was also a really good height. I have been seeing mushroom type of things for a while now. You need to let me know in the comments below if you like the mushroom design and everything pretty much. But that Sherpa mushroom ottoman was 150, but I was drawn to this coffee table, $400, a unique design. I love the wood tones in there. And then just the round is really appealing. This leather couch was on sale 30% off, so that's a good deal for that. And then I loved this marble and black coffee table right here, $350. This is a smaller version of that Everett table we saw near the beginning. This is $300, so if you love this table but don't have quite as much space as the bigger one, this smaller one might be a better option. My oldest daughter has this chair in her bedroom. We got like the medium gray color of cushion for the top, but it is so cozy, even I sit in it. This is a set of three tables for $400. The marble, again, is very sturdy and solid, but if you have a spot in your living room where you need a few of those and you like the cohesive look, that may be a good option. I always love looking at their art prints and these displays are just so fun. Ooh, 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 ooh. 
$90 for this little accent table right there. I love the gold and the marble together. When it is time for me to start decorating some more rooms in my house, I am definitely going to be taking a look at World Market first. I just love some of these pieces they have. This green couch was gorgeous. It was a beautiful sage color, so not too overpowering, but enough to make a little bit of statement. And the longer chase on the side was just beautiful. I also love the bench cushions on couches. It just makes it so much easier to kind of maintain that nice, clean look. This coffee table was 400. It was a nice light wood with a hint of gray in it. I love those rounded legs underneath. And then they also had a console table hiding behind this couch too that I thought was also amazing. That would look beautiful by a front door. They had a nice selection of these little poofs and again, kind of a bohemian vibe, but sometimes it is nice to weave in some of that subtle pattern into your home. I loved this abstract art piece. Abstract art is my favorite. I think you can just make it go with so many styles and the black and white was very classic. This coffee table, I loved the wood tones and the ridges on it, 400. So we're seeing similar prices throughout the store. They do have a nice selection of rugs with really pretty patterns. Not many that are just kind of neutral and plain, but I love the more vintage looking oriental type of rugs and they were so soft. Like this one right here was 120 for a five by seven. So maybe a little bit more than you'd pay on Amazon, but I think the prices are pretty comparable. This one right here with the black pattern on it was $2.50 for a seven and a half by nine and a half. So I thought that was a pretty good price. We are almost done going through World Market today. Here is a section of pillows that they have in the back and I am gonna show you a few lamps too. I hope you really enjoyed this video. I have some other fun stores coming up soon, so I can't wait to go shopping with you again. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you back here soon.